All right, so now we're going to talk about antibacterial hand soaps and toothpaste and things um, for your teeth that we can replace very easily using some completely chemical free products. So we're going to start off with antibacterial soaps. So the, the as you're going to see in the graphic below that I'll post below this post, the antimicrobial chemical triclosan is just one of the chemicals used in some toothpaste and antibacterial soaps. And it's believed to disrupt thyroid function and hormone levels in people when it's mixed, when it mixes into wastewater. It can cause sex changes in aquatic life. Many healthy experts believe that overuse of this and other antibacterial chemicals is promoting the growth of bacteria that are resistant to antibacterial treatment. In addition to triclosan, toothpaste can also include other harmful substances such as sodium lauryl sulfate, which is one of the worst ones. And that was one of the first chemicals that back when I first was in my 20s, and somebody was sharing this with me that they said, all right, go and just look in your bathroom and your hair products and your soap and your hand soap and your body soap and see if sodium lauryl sulfate is one of the ingredients. Um, there's also fluoride, aspartame, propylene glycol is also one of the really bad ones. You can find propylene glycol in so many things. And that along with sodium lauryl sulfate, those are a couple of the worst ones and they're found in almost everything. It's crazy. Um, even little microbeads, little plastic pellets, like that stuff is not good for you. So, so what do I do? What have I been using? So since I was in my twenties, I love the Thieves Aroma Bright toothpaste. I actually, you can buy it in these two ounce tubes or you can buy the big tubes. I like to buy the packs. Like it's like, I think it's a five pack of the two ounce because I like to have some in each bathroom and it's just easier to have the little bottles when I'm traveling. But there's a couple different ways that you can get this Thieves toothpaste. So this is what I use. This is what I've used for a long time. There are a couple different options as well from Young Living, um, some different like formulas. This just happens to be my favorite, but there are a couple other ones um, that you can find on the site. And I can even post them below. Den Dentrome Ultra and Dentrome Plus are also two different kinds of Thieves toothpaste. As well as I use the Thieves mouthwash. So I absolutely love this mouthwash. Actually a story um, of mine is when I was pregnant and I just happened to be one of the people that while I was pregnant it I would my gums would bleed when every time I would brush my teeth and the only thing that I could really get to just soothe and just stop kind of like the the slight bleeding was that I would rinse my mouth out with this mouthwash now is that what it's for not necessarily but that is a testimonial of mine but otherwise it's just a great breath freshener. I'll just take a little bit and I pour it into the cap and I take a swig and swish it around my mouth and I just, I love the taste. So, so I use the Thieves mouthwash and Thieves toothpaste. And then one of my favorites ever since I used this Thieves floss, every other kind of floss is just not good enough for me. I know that sounds funny, but I just love like the thickness and just how it really helps get stuff out of my teeth without grinding at my gums. Like some of the other ones that I have just feel like they're cutting at my gums and it's just something that is very soft as well as you get a lot in there. That is a lot of floss. Like this one floss will last me and I floss sometimes twice a day and it'll last me for a long time. And it's infused with thieves and peppermint oil, it says right here on the back. Mm -hmm. But if anybody wants to try some of this, let me know. I can send you a little bit in a baggie or something. But I absolutely love this. I've used it for 10 years. I love, 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 love this. So I'll post some more products below that are for the bathroom and for your teeth. And then for um, next, the antibacterial soap. So what do I use instead of antibacterial soap? Couple things. Okay, how do we save money doing this? 
Young Living has a couple of different hand soap options that I usually will buy in like a pack of three. So I'll get like three lavender and I'll get three of these. So how do I save money? Well, what's really awesome about Young Living products is that a lot of them are so concentrated that you don't have to use them at the strength that it comes in. So when you first get it, yes. Could you just take this and pop the foam foamer right on there and just use it? Yes, that's no problem. Um, <clears throat> but what I like to do is I start with one and then I wait till it gets like, you can see this one, oh, maybe you can see it. Um, it has about this much in there. So with that being said, um, once it starts to get down, sometimes I'll just add more water or I'll even just take like one of these new ones. I'll save one that's unopened and I'll take and I'll pour a little bit, like maybe an inch of this in there and fill the rest up with water and it'll still pump and be foamy and everything. And I actually, I'll start just gradually doing that with all my bottles to where pretty soon I'm just using one refill to just pour a little bit in each bottle and then add a bunch of extra water. Uh, another thing that I'll do is like, let's, if I'm totally out of refills, a super quick way to just make a foaming soap is to just put a little bit of just normal thieves cleaner in there, like a little tiny bit, maybe just like a little quarter inch down at the bottom and then fill the rest with water and you're going to have the same thing. So Young Living just makes it nice and easy putting it in a little foaming pump bottle, but you can definitely buy your own pump bottles. You can make it last longer. You can spread it out along the house and you can make these bottles last you a really long time. You don't have to feel like the cost is an issue because it's so much more, it's so much worth it when you're actually just like helping yourself and your family and increase your health. And with this thieves, you're helping to build your immune system at the same time that you're washing your hands instead of just washing your hands. And you know, the problem with antibacterial stuff is that it's not just killing the good, the bad bacteria, it's killing the good bacteria. And what we want to do is we just want to kill the bad. And because the oils are derived from plants, they have the intelligence to kill off the bad stuff, leave the good. And that's what I love. And just, I definitely keep the thieves in my kitchen because when I'm using like chicken and stuff on my hands and stuff, I love to just make, to use the thieves. And then in my bathroom, I will have the lavender, which I'll do the same thing. I'll wait for it to get down and I'll just kind of add water to it to just make it last a lot longer. And it works out great. So if you guys have any questions, let me know and comment below.